what if we sort of started new worlds all the time? So you're gonna log on, play with your friends, go on adventures, build, destroy, kind of do whatever you want in these worlds, and then once you've defeated it, we're gonna roll up a new one that is going to be a completely new experience the next time around. Putting it all together, putting it online, and that's gonna be Trove. The worlds are really uh, a combination of handcrafted content and auto-generated zones. And once we said, okay, we're gonna make new worlds for you to explore all the time, uh, we had to answer a lot of other interesting questions like, all right, how are we going to make it so the things you build carry over or show up again? How are we gonna save your progress? And answering those questions has really driven a lot of what the game has become. When you have a very small team, uh, you don't have the option to make a lot of content by hand. And so you need to come up with systems that are able to make the content that you want and put it together in ways that are interesting uh, and that, that are meaningful to the user. The voxels are great because you can build whatever kind of world you want to build. It's like taking Legos and anyone can pick up Legos and build something really cool with them really quick. We have the basics there. You can build things, you can destroy things, you can fight monsters. Um, you can actually even build things outside of the game that we have a pipeline for importing them into the game. There's this entire different energy that happens when you actually have real people playing your games and the developers and the players are interacting and that's the bit of magic that we really want to roll out as early as possible and make players a part of this experience of making this thing real. The thing that sets Trove most apart from the competition uh, is both being free to play uh, and direct community involvement in development of the game. We're going to be on Reddit, we're going to be on Twitter, interacting with the community, finding their feedback, finding the directions that they want uh, the game to go in. We have no ego. We don't think that our ideas are necessarily the best ideas. We think that we are good at curating ideas and putting them together into a cohesive whole. But the idea themselves could come from anywhere.